of Hollywood's biggest stars came out to support Elton John at his annual Elton John's Oscar viewing party. What a great night. So let's go out and find out more about what some of these fabulous A-list celebrities had to say about celebrating the Oscars at Elton John's party. I think we've both been incredibly impressed um, how the organization works over the last couple of years. We've been, this is our third year running, I think, and um, uh, it's worth coming just to hear Elton's speech, truthfully. So um, it's a wonderful thing to be part of, and we're very excited to be here. It's an incredibly important cause, and there's no night in this business that people are paying more attention to than Oscar night, you know? So I think it's amazing to be able to sort of use this night of celebration as also a way to raise awareness. Obviously, I mean, McConaughey is just on an incredible <laughs> roll right now. Um, there hasn't been anything we haven't loved of his lately. No. We were up this morning in bed watching True Detective. Um, I'm really pleased for Chiwetel that he's, I thought he did an amazing job. Um, and, and Jared Leto, of course. I mean, that, that, that's amazing. I really loved Kate Blanchett as well. And I also loved Sandra Bullock. So it's, I think it's a really strong year this year. It's not about being a celebrity when you're here. It's about the charitable work that Elton does and the lives that he saves and you get to wear a pretty dress at the same time. But this party. <laughs> it really is. This is the moment all the fashion designers come to, is the party where people know they can just let loose and have fun and just be themselves and no one's watching them or spying on them or anything. It's a fun party. I mean, they do such a great job of uh, raising so much money for AIDS research, and you know, this is my annual thing I do every single year. So anything to support those guys, I'm here. I think people here have way more fun. <laughs> I really do. I mean, I've I've been to pretty much every single Oscar party known to man, and uh, I've never had more fun than the Elton John party because everyone comes here and everyone just has a blast. I won my Oscar pool for sure tonight because I got every single one of them, even the her screenplay I chose. Uh, so yeah, I think I'm gonna be a winner tomorrow when I look at all this. I mean, I come every year. Alan John's a Brit. I love what he stands for. He always throws a massive, huge bash with great performances. Yeah, this is the place to be at. Well, it's just amazing what he does. I mean, every single year, it's like all the celebrities come out, all the winners come out, they come and they support him. And he's just been such a compassionate person, you know. And he, the work that he does is just so amazing. It's really beautiful. He always gives back. Ellen DeGeneres is just incredible. She's so funny. I love her. I mean, the fact that she passed out pizza to everybody, it's just great. Everyone's stylist was probably like, no, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> the white jackets are like, stop, please. And taking selfies. She cool. did the selfie situation. I know, she's so of this generation. Organization. Organization. I'm a big advocate of it and just lending your voice, lending in your time, coming to these. It's just really important to do that. For me, the biggest carpet that I'll always remember and it still blurs the first twilight. So everything compared to that, you just feel like a beetle and all the fans came out. This was more subdued and just a, a different pedigree. So it's quite enjoyable being there, watching the show. Ellen did an amazing job, and I'm just so proud of all the winners. If I'm in LA, I do this with Elton. Elton's been an old friend, and we've worked on a lot of AIDS committees together. So yeah. this is a great cause, and why not? Because uh, he's my best friend, because he's, uh, he's so generous. The work he did with this foundation is amazing. I think people who are, who are famous in a certain way, this is something they should do. Yeah? They should use their popularity to help other people. And Elton has been done this forever, and I always admire him. It's just the best party in town. <laughs> it's one of those parties you look forward to all year. It's all about yes. Elton, and he's such an amazing man, such a good man, he's such a great humanitarian, and that he's, his spirit is just so bright. It's, when you're in his company, it's the best. What makes this different is the host. Both David and Elton are so beyond benevolent. Like They go around literally to every single table, every single person and greet. And they sort of, it's, there's a reason why they've raised over $300 million and they continue to sort of create awareness for the foundation. It's great. 
Look, it's, it's Sir Elton. Like, <laughs> you get goosebumps just in the, the days leading up to this party, and um, you sort of leave with a real sort of sense of uh, almost soulfulness in a way. And I can't say that about too many other Hollywood parties where you feel like you've actually been satisfied. And it's more than the meal, and it's more than just the, the razzmatazz. There's a genuineness about this night. I have a very long relationship with Elton and I love what he does for the AIDS community and for health at large and um, he's done an amazing thing. He raises 40 million dollars with this event alone and, um, and it's a fun time and I just love him too. People love him, you know, um, I love him. He's been a, an, an amazing um, encourager of, of musicians even still, you know, he still listens to music, he still um, promotes young people making their first time records and he's out there talking about them and tweeting and, um, you know, he's just the consummate musician and, and we love him. and everyone's beautiful and you know it's, it's it's fantastic but because how he's combining his philanthropy with fabulousness that's why and why this is the night that everybody waits the Super Bowl of Hollywood and I think it's important to remember that all of us together can truly as you know cliche as it sounds we really can make a difference so here we are in all this room he can have, he has a wrapped audience and can raise a crap load of money this is a great party if you like like movies and he always introduces some new music thing it's just a great party it? lovely love being of service to him and all that there's really nothing else i can say nebraska was a huge surprise to me how sweet it was and i loved it after all the drama this year it's really i'm a comedian so i love to see a little bit of sense of humor in it. but i think the lego movie was really what i like best the, the performance in the lego movie well, we're friends of Elton's uh, for many, many years, and David, and uh, we love them, and we think that their work that they do is it's extraordinary. I mean, I've been to the event in London probably eight times, and um, he's just, he puts his money where his mouth is, they both do, as a team, and it's extraordinary, and he never lets up. I was driving here tonight thinking, maybe he'll just not do it one year, but that's not his style. You know, he's just going to keep going until this problem's licked. It's like really exciting because I know Elton, I like the charity, it's a good one. I'm on all the AIDS charities in Baltimore, so this is the more glamorous one, even though the Baltimore one's good too. I like what Elton's doing. I like what his whole thing is all year long. He does events, raises money for charities that he feels important to him, and I want to be part of it. I think it's very cool. I mean, you know, it's a big decision. You can only be one place at a time, but this, is, this party's always fun. We were born within about three miles of one another and uh, I'm a huge fan of his and, and especially of what he's doing in terms of humanitarian issues, so this is a great party. I think uh, Kate Blanchett, uh, McConaughey, um, actually I thought Bruce Stern was pretty amazing, I love Nebraska, I hope something happens for Nebraska. And of course, you know, 12 Years a Slave, I think it's going to win everything. Thank you very much. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to the Elton John AIDS Foundation 22nd Annual Academy Awards Viewing Party. We're so glad and thrilled that you could join us this evening to celebrate the achievements of all the Oscar nominees. More importantly, we're here together to be a part of the beginning of the end of AIDS. What a, a great and amazing night we've had. Congratulations to all of tonight's Oscar winners and congratulations to all of you here in the room. Look at all of the pledges that have come in this evening. Look at the thousands of people you've helped tonight. The film that just won was about liberating people, about liberating people from an awful life of slavery. And what we're trying to do is to liberate people from the stigma and the disease of AIDS. And your generosity tonight has been amazing and hopefully will continue to be amazing.